Hey everybody, Mark Agnesi here in the back room with Norman's Rare Guitars, and welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. Reading through the uh, comments yesterday, I think Angered Cheese's mom is might be taking a little turn for the better here. Things are starting to look good. We like to hear that. Yeah. I think that I would like to think that some of this uh, positive thought here in the comment section on YouTube might have something to do with it. Probably doesn't, but I'm glad to hear. <laughs> that she's doing better. That's really great yeah. news. Our thoughts continue to stay with Angered Cheese, his family, and of course, his mom. Um, let's see, what else? It's Flat Top Friday. We really have been on a roll again with the Gibson Acoustics on Flat Top Friday. If you're sick of that, sorry, but we got another one today, so you're gonna have to deal with it. Uh, but it's another good one. It's another banner. We love the banners here. I love the banners. And this is another kind of weird and rare one that I think you guys are really gonna like. Let's do it. Come on back. This thing is from 1943. It's another Gibson Banner J45 original sunburst finish. But what's really cool about this one is it's shipped with a mahogany top. So this thing is all mahogany, top sides and back. Yes. And that's not uncommon, man. We were talking about that last week. We did the uh, that rosewood back inside Southern Jumbo that had like the unbound dot neck on it. It's totally weird. They did J45s. They probably did the most J45s and they probably did the most variations on that. So you're gonna have spruce top ones with mahogany back and sides. This is the mahogany back and sides with the mahogany top. They did the maple back and sides ones. I think we did one of those uh, maybe 150 some episodes ago with the maple back and they did some rosewood back and then they did some that are like maple sides with rosewood back. There was a middle of a war, man. Whatever they had, they did. And like we were saying uh, last week as well, um, this one has no truss rod. This is uh, an early one, like I said, 43. So how do you uh, make a guitar's neck not move when it doesn't have a truss rod? You make it as big as a freaking tree trunk. Yes. That's how. Make it so big it can't move. <laughs> Love it. Big, huge, chunky neck. Yeah. Um, so this is going to sound a little bit different. The mahogany does kind of mellow out the guitar a little bit, but in a good way. Um, sounds great with the finger style stuff. Um, sounds really good uh, strummed hard with the pick too. Um, and if you don't watch us every week or every day, which you should, um, what's a banner? Oh yeah, it's just the era of Gibson guitars where they put this banner on the headstock. It says only Gibson is good enough. You'll see that run from 1942 up until about uh, late 1945, maybe even some early 1946s, but right up until about 1945. Uh, they were made by the Kalamazoo gals, a whole bunch of women who never built guitars before. Um, when all the men shipped off to the war, Gibson brought in these women uh, who didn't necessarily know how to make guitars, but they were great with their hands. Sewers, needlepoint, crocheters, really good detail people, and built what I think probably the greatest era Gibson flat top guitars of all time. Enough talking, let's go do some tickling. <laughs> and we'll, it gets her every time, man, I love it. It's just like an insane. We'll it. tickle a little, little bit, we'll kick the piss out of it with a flat pick. We'll see how it responds, we'll all have a great time, and we'll go home and have drinks. What do you say? <laughs> let's do it. All right, we're out front. We have the 1943 Gibson Banner J45 with the mahogany top, original sunburst finish. We'll put it through the paces a little bit here. We'll start with the fingers. We'll hit it with the pick in a little bit.
Cool, let's pick up a flat pick. Let's lay into this thing a little bit harder here, see how it responds when we hit it. Oh yeah, there you have it. 1943 original Gibson Banner J45. This is another one of those kind of oddballs. This one shipped with a mahogany top and mahogany back and sides. All mahogany J45. Got the rosewood board, rosewood bridge. Of course, you got that banner on the headstock. It says, only Gibson is good enough. Yeah, these are my favorite. They're the best. Hey, follow me on Instagram at Mark Agnesi. Follow the store at Norman's Rare Guitars. And check this and the rest of these guitars out online at normansrareguitars.com. We only got one more guitar of the day coming at you this week. Oh yeah, it's freaking Stratter Day. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.